playing uh, Ghost Runner, you know. Because I enjoy it. It's fun. Plus, hopefully you guys do. So I think this is where we left off. It's been the moment, too. Or three. Or four. Or five. You know what I mean? We're now moving from the sector's main factory complex. No law here anymore. Just key master's goons pushing everyone around and shouting orders. You didn't I obey. Some yeah. of us didn't. You had visited the base often in the past. Towards the end of our time, this place became overrun with criminals. The ghost runners kept them at bay until Mara took over. Open your eyes. Wake up to me. I love this game. The graphics are so good. Yeah. I like the combat mechanics and the movement. Just... These factories. Everything they produce goes straight up to Dharma City. While the Keymaster and her lackeys live in luxury, we basers work our fingers to the bone our whole lives and don't see any of it. How do you survive? When I was little, we were given basic provisions, but each year we'd get less and less. If not for the black market, we would have all starved by now. The Keymaster keeps taking while giving nothing back. So you chose to fight? Not much of a choice, really. 
efficiency of Dharma City hydroponic farms dwindles, so even the upper levels will suffer. Mara can't feed everyone. Even if she wanted to. I could have easily skipped a year, but... Some decided to fight back. My parents, their friends, Saul. They weren't afraid to speak up against Mara and remind us that things used to be different. The resistance started because some of us remembered the time before the Keymaster. What this time? Supposedly, she wanted to unlock our chains, set us free. <laughs> yeah, right. Free from the Architect. Probably. Strange. The keys are nearly gone. Not regrouping at the usual location. They're just retreating. Returning to the city. Not returning. Leaving. Most of the keys are local and never go up there. This is unusual.
Because I'm feeling generous, I am going to do another level. So, two levels in one episode. Uh. Okay. It's loading for what a long time. The air filtering facility is just ahead. Why is Mara doing this? It's punishment for rebelling against her. She wants to make an example of us, to keep the other sectors in line. Sometimes even your current speed won't be enough. Look for cyber void uplinks to temporarily disable safety limiters and increase acceleration. Use them sparingly though. You don't want to damage yourself. What are these uplinks? Think of them as loose cables you can grab onto for extra power. 
Although they can be much more dangerous than electricity.
the installation remains intact, the contamination is reversible. The Keymaster cares less about lives and more about production lines. I keep trying to contact the other climbers, get help. No luck so far. Maybe they're laying low. Maybe. Maybe. They're quite literally laying low on the ground. Dead. How do you know? I've seen the bodies. Some cameras around the base are still operational. The climbers have been expunged.
infection is spreading by the minute. Radioactive dust concentration is already 50 times above normal. <laughs> Hold on. Don't worry. Spacers are tough. I'll be fine as long as you bring the filters back online. And so will everyone.
done. You saved the day. Now you can get back to more important matters. You did it. Thank you, Jack. The people of Sector 5 owe you their lives. I'm so glad we found you. How did you find me? Sheer luck. You were buried in a scrap heap at the bottom of a derelict shaft. You fell a long way, didn't you? Feels like it. I wish you'd been there when they came for us. What happened? Key surprised us at the hideout. Kicked down the door out of nowhere. Then we ran. I got separated.
that the Keymaster will send in more troops to finish the job later. There'll be no later for Mara. Okay, that's it for this Ghost Runner episode. I really hope you enjoyed because I did.